Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get a very easy Joltik to spawn in the Indigo Disc DLC. So, if you're going to do this video, be sure to like, subscribe, brand new, and let's just jump right on into it. So, first thing we're going to want to do is make our way on the map to the Charge Stone Cavern. Now, it's not just the Charge Stone Cavern that we need to be in, but this is the best place to spawn uh, Joltiks, and also we are going to need a shiny sandwich so the best place for joltic to spawn is you've seen it in the trailers where the electro webs are so just follow the character uh just literally down the middle it's not too bad jump on your ride and you can literally see it um as soon as you go down and just make your way through this little passageway and then you're basically in the electro web bits like this is the best place to find yourself the shiny joltic and obviously you get the tm and everything there which is obviously still pretty good um so what we need to do now is make ourselves a picnic. As you can see, there is a garbantula there, but, you know, we are going to be needing Joltik uh, for this guide. And you're going to want to make a bug-type sandwich, because electric-type does spawn in Joltik, but it does also spawn in Electabuzz and all that boring stuff we don't care about today. And bug-type is obviously cherry tomato and two salties. This is the only sandwich I recommend the salties on, because, oh my god, is it difficult if you don't have the correct um, thingy because these are hard to make because they just fall around everywhere and you can't even see so this is the best way to uh, do it and uh, yeah the reason why it's bug is because Joltik and Gavantula are electric bug type and uh, they are the only bug type to spawn in charged stone cavern to my knowledge um so uh, yeah and I found this one myself that's probably common sense Um, I haven't actually seen this one on a guide or anything yet as a recording and um yeah i don't know i just thought it made sense so i gave it a go and it worked um so yeah after you've made it as you can see it's sparkling title and encounter for the bug type which is what we're going to need and literally all we have to do now is walk around this area and before you know it in about 10 20 seconds the area is flooded <laughs> with joltic so yeah, it should be quite easy to get the shiny. The shiny is not that noticeable. I think the legs turn black rather than blue. It's not too bad, but Jotic's tiny, so your best bet is to send your Pokemon out and have your Pokemon attack him and then find them that way. As you can see, that what was that? 10 seconds, just looped around the thing, and we are flooded with Joltic. You can go through that tiny cavern there on the left, but it's there's really no point um so uh, yeah a shorter one today but that's how you can get very easy shine joltic to spawn in the dlc hope you guys did enjoy it. if you did be sure to give a like subscribe if you're brand new i want to thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in a little bit